Tonight on the night team, how you park your car in Louisville is becoming a real problem for police and the public safety, especially if you legally carry a gun with you and forget to do one very important thing. WHS 11 night team's Connor Steffen and senior photojournalist Alyssa Newton show you why Metro Police and the Louisville ATF are frustrated. Simple measures is just to be a responsible, safe gun owner to prevent in some cases immeasurable loss. These firearms will be used in other crimes, so homicides, non-fatal shootings, aggravated assaults, as well as uh, other types of uh, violations. That's how Louisville ATF Special Agent AJ Gibbs absolutely, yeah, explains uh, yeah, solving so a recent uh, problem similar. facing law enforcement in the city. How you park your car could solve it all. The, the issue at hand is that there's an increased report or numbering of uh, firearms that have been stolen or reported stolen from vehicles in uh, Jefferson County. Through the first seven and a half months of 2023, LMPD reports 162 guns have been stolen across the county, many from cars. Uh, I wouldn't say that it's necessarily common, but sometimes there might be a situation where uh, an individual may think that this is the safest place to store it at that time, uh, so it, it can happen. It mirrors statewide trends seen in the Commonwealth, 14,000 guns stolen over the last five years. Uh, we have seen a trend or that's ticked up year after year, uh, so that, that is a trend that LMPD is working on and we're partners with them. LMPD wants to take a few minutes and discuss an issue. that As outlined in this recent public service announcement posted to LMPD social media, officers are now asking for your help. The Louisville ATF says there's one important step you can take to prevent items in your car from being stolen. It's actually quite simple. Lock your car door before you leave. In fact, maybe it's just easier now because people aren't taking those extra efforts to lock vehicle doors or lock their residences. There's also uh, this. This particular form is uh, produced by ATF and this allows a personal firearm record gun owners can fill out. It serves as both a personal record for the owner and a crucial tool for law enforcement. So like doing this, how much does it help law enforcement and ATF? Oh, uh, tremendously, because without a serial number, it's going to make it very difficult to be able to link uh, both the crime to a subject who committed it, but then also get that firearm uh, back to the firearm mm -hmm. owner themselves. Yeah. The ATF says thefts like this can happen anywhere. The silver lining, there's plenty of simple measures to take that could very well save lives and curb an ongoing issue. In Louisville, Connor Steff in the WHAS 1119 on your side. The ATF also advises buying a car compatible lockbox where you can store your guns. You should also keep items out of plain sight while you're away from your car. To find and maintain a personal firearms record, we've got a link for you to the ATF website on whs11.com.